A Year in Girl Guiding Edinburgh. Hi everyone, my name is Lindsay and I am Girl Guiding Edinburgh's County Commissioner. Welcome to our 2020 to 21 annual review. We all know the last year has been a hard one and I don't want to dwell on it for too long, but I do want to acknowledge the commitment and dedication of all our members. Lockdown has forced us to change the way we do guiding and to try new ways of delivering engaging and exciting opportunities for our girls and young women. You will hear shortly about some of the things we've been up to over the past year. None of these things would have been possible without our volunteer leaders, unit helpers, treasurers, administrators, commissioners, who have worked tirelessly to make sure everything they do is safe and more importantly fun. I cannot say thank you enough to all of our volunteers. I'd also like to say a huge thank you to all our parents, carers and families who have supported us through the last year. Whether you've sat through the weekly Zoom calls with your rainbow or brownie, you've helped with interest badges, filled in consent forms or attended virtual sleepovers, we could not have given your daughters any of the opportunities we have without your help, so thank you. Finally, I also want to acknowledge our Rainbows, Brownies, Guides, Rangers, Young Leaders and members of Girl Guiding Inspire. I am so proud of each and every single one of you for embracing the challenge this year has thrown at you. You have laughed when times have been hard. You have listened to each other and made each other smile. And you have taught us how to use Zoom filters. And you've been honest when you've been feeling sad. I've learned so much from each of you and I can't wait to meet you in person. You are all superstars. Despite the challenge this year has thrown at us, our members have achieved a huge amount. We have handed out 201 bronze awards, 81 silver awards and 68 awards to our young members. On top of these awards, hundreds of brownies, guides, rainbows and rangers have completed interest badges, skills builders, theme awards and thousands of challenge badges. I want to say a particular congratulations to Mary Ferrier, who has awarded, been awarded the Queen's Guide Award. This is the highest award a young member can achieve in guiding. Our volunteers have also gained awards and qualifications with 24 volunteers completing their adult leadership qualification and two young leaders completing the young leader qualification. We will soon be presenting our awards for long service to leaders who have been volunteering for more than five years. And one leader, Sheila Smith, will receive a 60 year long service award. Massive congratulations to everyone who has achieved a qualification or award this year. We're so proud of all of you. Now, to tell you more about what we've been up to in Girl Guiding Edinburgh this year, I'm going to hand over to Rosie Burgess, Chair of our Guiding Development Team. In March 2020, the world stood still. We waited, we watched, until... All at once and all in a hurry, our wise old owls and not so old owls. Those wonderful owls spent hours and hours surrounded by paperwork, risk assessments, emails, a testament to their love and commitment to our girls who deserve to be cheerfully, joyfully playing so gleefully rather than locked down at home. In Edinburgh County, our brownies and guides, our rangers and rainbows have thrived despite challenges COVID has thrown at us. We sold our headquarters, but lockdown has taught us there's much more to guiding than just bricks and mortar. We've done baking, creating, craft making, more baking, art out in nature and on our computers, lots of crafts using paper, new things to get used to. Halloween parties, anniversaries, silent discos, people bingos. Solved crimes, made slime, things with string, more baking. We've had opportunities, helped our communities, working together we help other people, see? 
Letters to nursing homes, pictures on lots of stones, picked lots of litter, made things using glitter. Made stuff with recycling, knots and more things with string and yes, more baking. Despite all the challenges lockdown has thrown at us, we've done what we can to be well. Our peer educators have been here to help us to think more resilient and made us feel brilliant. We've learned guiding history, explored genealogy, spent time just mummy and me. We practiced some semaphore, made placards campaigning for changes we wanted to see. In April, for Easter, we coloured and looked for eggs in our Easter egg hunt. To help first-time voters, our county promoted a hustings for girls and young women. We've been all over the world and returned without ever leaving our homes. We had sleepovers, campfires, marshmallows and songs, all of the things that we've missed for so long. We camped under tables and cupboards and gardens. We missed all our leaders and friends. It was hard and we didn't know how and we didn't know when we would ever be all back together again. Now lockdown is easing, we're starting to see in the parks and on bridges and beaches, our Girl Guiding members getting back together whatever the weather, oh, Edinburgh. For all of our 3,761 rainbows and brownies and guides and rangers, young leaders and members of Girl Guiding Inspire, to every volunteer, all 1,104 of you incredible unsung heroes who have made it through a frankly ridiculous year. The sooner we get back together, the better, but until that day, no one can say we did any less. We did all we could. We kept our promise. We did our best. This year's Long Service Awards go to... The Five Years Service Awards go to... Kim Anderson Gail Armour Emily Beaver Hannah Booth Hannah Braniff, Laura Briggs, Jenny Brown, Claire Cooper, Carla Davy, Rosemary Dawson, Gillian Denham, Gillian Forster, Sharon Fraser, Joe Gaffney, Susie Gifford. Megan Hanna, Katie Hannon, Emma Hunt, Ellie Kenton, Rosie Mayer, Anisha Macadia, Amy Martin, Poppy Mason Smith, Kirsty Matheson, Ashley McCall, Gail McElroy, Eric McMahon, Katie Oldfield, Marjorie O'Neill, Imogen Page, Isla Panton, Louise Rowlings, Eleanor Swift, Danny Thumaya, Sophie Thrippleton, Hannah Trudeau, Kirsten Tyrrell, Sarah Waterfield, Isla Waitley, Laura Williamson, Siobhan Willis, Alicia Wilson, Cara Whipperfeld, Jill Young, The 10 Year Service Awards are presented to Emma Bird, Finley Clements, Fiona Daz, Amy Davis, Amanda Easton, Kristen Fox, Shona Gao, Nicole Highland, Jennifer Henderson, Rosemary Island, Kirsty Laidlaw, Denise McCaig, Janet Muff, Roz Perkins, Sarah Truick, Fiona Vanell, Helen Ward, Hope Wilson. The 20 Year Service Awards are presented to Lizzie Bell, Fiona Blair, Catherine Buchanan, Alison Eady, Verity Hancock, 
Karen Herbert, Nicola McDermott, Claire Peacock, Caroline Santamu, Lindsay Stitt. The 30 Year Service Awards are presented to Patricia Blakey, Lynn Gracie, Nicola McKenzie, Kirsty Murray, Carol Rennie, Sharon Robertson, Diane Santana, the 40 Years Awards are presented to Francis Allen, Linda Banks, Audrey Gao, Elizabeth Mackey, the 50 Years Service Awards are presented to Joan Bell, Elma Tate, and the 60 Year Service Awards are presented to Sheila Smith. Congratulations to all of our Long Service Award recipients. On behalf of everyone at Girl Guiding Edinburgh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.